I'm Ashley McKenzie. I'm the patient navigator for the West Virginia Impact Program, and my role is to help families affected by substance use disorder um, improve their quality of life and access resources within the community. I think the support, I think, um, in these families, oftentimes what we find is that they don't have the support. So just being an ear um, to validate their feelings and feel like they're being truly heard has been really crucial for our families. Sometimes it's a phone call and just um, checking in if you know they have a doctor's appointment or if the baby has an appointment, checking in to make sure that everything's going okay, um, especially with court hearings. A lot of times there's court cases um, involving these families and I think providing them feeling that someone's invested in them. So there's so many resources out there. There's so many things that um, evolve every day. So making sure that they're able to access all of these things, whether it's utility assistance or um, childcare resources to get things subsidized so that um, you know they have extra money. Um, just all of these community resources that are out there and the support that provides um, trainings that are provided through the IMPACT program to educate them on what to expect with an NAS baby. Um, all of those things that IMPACT provides. Sure, we've had families, um, we've had lots of successes with our families. Specifically, um, I had a dad come to me, his, he was, he had no idea that the mom was pregnant, um, found out while the mom was in the hospital and was told, come get your child. So he had no idea that his baby had been exposed to substances. And in that, he had electric bills that were through the roof that she was supposed to be paying on and he had no idea that she wasn't making those payments. So to help him out, we were able to access community resources through churches, through um, different grants that are in the state and then impact funding as well to help him get rid of those bills so that he could focus on his new um, role as being a dad to two little girls, not just one. Yeah. So that was huge for him. Um, he called me in tears, just couldn't even believe that this was happening to him and so grateful for the West Virginia Impact Program. What is that process? So the process they could go to um, WV, wvimpact.org um, and make a referral. Anyone can make a referral or they can reach out to me directly at aemckenzie at bumfs.org.